you know, what is the role of technology in supporting employee experience? I mean, that to me is um, is absolutely at the heart of it all. I mean, I think we are, and this is where I think again the scale up piece has been interesting for me. We're just about to implement a new ATS technology that we will have kind of probably done and implemented in the sort of one to two months. Yeah. And, and and I think that speed to adoption and sort of implementation is just at a rate that I've never seen. And I think that what I see here right now is all these these disruptors, a bit like ourselves in our market, coming in with sort of point products. And and I think what's going to be really important for HR people is to sort of not just buy things for the sake of buying things and launch them as like to really take a step back and go, okay, what is you're trying to do here? What What is the overarching goal and what's the kind of architecture of things? But like, you know, if you're not embracing technology, um, I genuinely think like you, you, you're, you're going to do yourself out of a job very shortly in this world, in our profession, because I think it's just, it's changing everything. And I think that sort of idea of what um, Netflix did to the kind of movie industry, that's happening right now, I think, in our business. And I think it's like, okay, we'll embrace it, see the opportunity, move yourself up the stack in terms of where you're adding value and um, be okay with this sort of automation and digitization that's going on and think about that experience, like experience that we love when we buy from Amazon, because it's just so simple, it's so intuitive, it, it makes our life so easy and we all all still go and oh god that just arrived, I just put it, I put it in my car just a few hours ago and it's here. Like that is, that experience I think is, you know, more and more expected in this particularly hybrid workplace where people are kind of going from Amazon to whatever they're doing transactionally in their employer and then expecting that similar level of experience. So I think we've got, to, I just think we've just got to embrace it. And I think, you know, it's not easy. So I would sit and say that's the, the bit. It's easy to say, it's much harder to do, but I think that is just the huge opportunity for, for our function. In this series, we will be speaking to a range of senior leaders who are pushing a data-driven and digital HR agenda. Make sure that you subscribe via your podcast app of choice and also via our YouTube channel for free and regular interviews with the digital HR leaders of the future.